guys. Knife Detector here. And oh my gosh, I had to do a video on this one. Guys, this is a beautiful knife. And you're not going to believe what I paid for it. You know, lately, you know, I've been paying the same amount for several different knives. $35 seems to be the magic number. Whenever there's a best offer type format on knives, I usually offer $35, even if the knife is uh, listed as twice that. And I've been getting lucky. Uh, a while back, you saw me make a video on a Spyderco, $35. I made an offer for that one. Um, I got another Spyderco coming up soon in another video, $35 for that one. $35 for this one, plus shipping, guys. Now, I couldn't believe it when I got it, honestly, because this is a beautiful case sleeve board knife. Look at that gray smooth bone, guys. Look at that gray smooth bone. It is beautiful. Now, I will tell you this. It did list some flaws, and that's why I got this uh, cheap. Can you see the flaws? Huh? How about on this side? You see any? Yep, there's a couple of cracks. There's one right on the pin, but from far away you can't even notice the thing. And then there's another right there. Sometimes you come across an honest seller. And that seller was so honest that because uh, this knife had a couple of flaws, that seller went ahead and was selling this thing for, I think, like 45 bucks, And I made him an offer of 35 I got it right away. Uh, this is a beautiful knife. This knife stands at about four inches long closed. It is a beautiful sleeve board type knife. Now, sleeve board knives are very similar to elephant toe knives, it's just they're not as wide. They're a little bit more narrow, as you can see. They usually have two blades in them. They have the big blade, and sometimes they have a smaller blade that looks like a sheep's foot right there. It's a beautiful, beautiful knife. Let's take a closer look. Let's check the snap. Perfect. Perfect snap, guys. Okay. The talk's a little weak, but still pretty good. You see my fingerprint right there. Ha. Ha. You see my reflection? Ha. So this is a beautiful knife, guys. Look at that little blade. That's very reminiscent of a blade that an elephant toe knife might have or uh, some type of uh, sunfish knife might have. Look at that little fake edge there, swedge, nail nick, limited edition, double X, one of 2,500. Look at that. Case. X, X, and X beautiful knife. I had to make this video. This video from where I'm standing right now, today is, I believe it's August the 1st. This video probably won't come out for another couple of weeks, guys, but I wanted to already carry this bad boy in my pocket. So I'm going to make this video now. Okay. Check this out. Let's look at the box for a little bit. Now I contemplated keeping this box only because, you know, it's so old. There you have the regular case information that comes with it never really been opened um i don't think i'm going to space is really an issue with me but check that out item number and it has a 70 there i'm not sure what that is maybe it's a replica replica of a model from 1970 6270 stainless steel uh m s m sleeve board no it's a sleeve board uh black limited edition and then there's the year, 08-22-2000. This knife is 20 years old, guys, going on 21 years old. It's a beautiful knife. And even the box, you can see the age on the box. Unique handles, antique shields, and limited production. No wonder XX limited edition knives are so highly prized by collectors right now. You're holding one of only 2,500 double X limited edition knives issued in this particular pattern. So don't let it out of your sight. You may never see one like it again, buddy. <laughs> okay, it doesn't say buddy, but you get the idea. So, man, I had to do this. I had to show you this picture. Uh, Jersey, I know you're going to fall in love with this one. Uh, Pete, I know you're going to love this one. Uh, this is a beautiful knife. You know, uh, gosh, does it get better than this? I don't know. This reminds me a lot of my Shatton Morgan Wildcat Driller. Reminds me a lot. Of course, that one is just as long, but a little bit wider around the edges.
All right, guys, this is a knife detector signing off. I got lots of different videos. Don't be scared to go check out uh, some of my playlists, y'all. Y'all take care. God bless y'all. Uh, keep your knives sharp and keep your wits even sharper.